Hello, everybody, and welcome to the first episode of AI for Engineers. My name is Yusef, Product Marketing Engineer here at Monolith, and today I'm going to show you a workflow that reduces the time you take to perform physical tests that typically takes weeks to reduce it to just minutes using Monolith. Using the so-called dashboard, I will demonstrate how we can predict the outcome of our physical tests in real time upstream in the product development process. In this video, I will first explain three reasons why engineers benefit from Monolith dashboards. Next, I will demonstrate the Monolith dashboard using a 3D AI example. And last, I will provide information on how you can sign up for a one-to-one -one demo solving your engineering problems. Let's get after it. As an engineer, you might ask yourself, why would I need a dashboard in the first place? And there are three primary reasons for that. Immediacy, collaboration, and the time-saving aspect. Let me first tackle the immediacy aspect. Monolith is specifically built by engineers for you, the engineers. As I'll show you in the dashboard in a few seconds, you can immediately get insights from your own data. You, the engineers in front of the screens watching this video right now, you are the domain experts and you know about your problems better than anyone else in the company. You can get access to domain expertise in one simple no-code application. The second point that I'd like to mention is collaboration. You can share your dashboards with your colleagues no matter where they are in the world, whether it's with your Thailand manufacturing colleagues or your colleagues in Silicon Valley from the design team. Gone are the days of sharing screenshots or single value results of tests using boring emails or slide decks. Third, we have the time saving aspect. Developing, deploying, and maintaining robust and secure cloud applications is an incredibly time consuming and tedious process. It's also very expensive and requires a team of experts. The Monolith platform is ready to use and once you log into your account, you can immediately get started building self-learning models in a no-code environment. Monolith's interactive shareable dashboards allow your team of engineers to explore data in a clear and configurable way. And using your engineering test data, you can quickly understand and instantly predict the performance of your complex system under more operating conditions than you ever imagined. All of that for unseen configurations of your product or scenarios without doing the actual physical test. Let me now show you a notebook in Monolith and how it can be transformed into a so-called dashboard. What you see on the screen right here is what we call a notebook. This is where we import the data, build the models, visualize the data, but also get insights into our data and make predictions of unseen test scenarios. In order to build a dashboard, it's relatively simple. We go to this little icon right here, which says dashboards from this notebook. We can either access already existing dashboards or we can generate new dashboard using this button right here. Let's just say for the sake of explanation, we want to generate a new dashboard. To create a dashboard, it's really as simple as selecting tick boxes, which is the key steps of the notebook. We can then drag and drop these pins into place and in 30 seconds, a custom cloud-based AI app has been created and deployed. In this case, I want to have the filter category in my dashboard, the 3D viewer lookup, and the scalar prediction. I click Generate Dashboard, and it only takes a couple of seconds, and the dashboard will appear. I can then drag and drop all these panes into place. And what I would then do is I can share it with my colleagues. And the best part, Users can easily and seamlessly interact with the results, changing parameters in real time, and get instant feedback. So in this example, for the 3D AI example, we select another type of rim. It would give us a new rim design. And for that unseen rim design, it would predict the drag coefficient for that particular new rim right here. This does not only work for 3D designs, but literally any notebook that you are building inside of Monolith. What you can see right here is that we've built a sustainability dashboard. It took me less than 30 seconds to build this. What I can do is I can select different cardboards, different manufacturing processes, and have dragging sliders to change the parameters of my cardboards. For example, let me change the thickness and make the cardboard thicker. And that would immediately give me insights into the scalar predictions such as the recyclability that we have defined, as well as the cost. And it would give me a new curve prediction on the right side. And whenever you want, you can basically edit your dashboard, add new modules to the dashboard, or remove existing ones, and then update your dashboard. 
Our customers already use this solution to report work to other colleagues, even from other departments. We also have customers who have a dedicated team building only notebooks and dashboards. For example, imagine if you're an aerodynamics engineer in a wind tunnel. And sharing these dashboards then with the design team. And there are even customers who share dashboards with their own clients. This is a key component in AI for engineering R&D processes that makes knowledge much more accessible within an organization, retaining lessons learned across generations of engineers. Working with the world's top automotive engineering companies, such as BMW, they can clearly see the full benefit when using AI models capable of predicting multiple performance metrics to help in decision making. And indeed, by using Monolith, users can paint a holistic picture of the performance of new designs which helps them understand the trade-off which may exist and make better informed decisions. In particular, the ability to forecast late-stage performance in the early stages of a product development process can help engineering teams prioritize design and engineering effort in areas of their product which may have otherwise required costly U-turns in the development. If you would like to learn more about Monolith and how it can help you augmenting or enhancing your current engineering workflows, please check out the links in the description. This was the first video in the AI for Engineers series, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.